Duncan is a hydrated boy. No. Yeah, sure. Uh, um... I had two dinners tonight. <laughs> you want him alive? Twenty fucking funny points. I'm Daniel. We just done the task. Enjoy, fuckers! We're back, and this year we've got 32 people hunting Harry Betty across Glasgow. The format is much the same as last year's, with a few key differences. Teams of four or five have to solve every single challenging clue we throw at them, one after another. First team to complete the last challenge wins 200 pounds. Now, on to the team roundup. Yo, listen up, it's time to begin. Introducing Sam Skimmons, the lyrical kingpin. It's me, it's Paul, yeah. Yo, it's me, Duncan. I'm introverted as fuck now, Toby. Yo, it's Toby, I'll meet you at the shed, and then I'll meet you at the garage, and then I'll meet you at Fire War, and then I'll get checked out. And, and I'm Finley, and we are the imp Holy fuck! It's Aaron Watson and Harry Betty fighting! God. Oh my god! This is Charlie. Hello, my heart rate is 108 to 70 in a minute. This is who the team is named after. This little mother clucker here. Introduction, that's what it is, isn't it? Yep. Yes. Kyle Beans, martial status, single. I'm in for indecent exposure. <laughs> Aaron Watson, uh, single. Um, Kill the child. Mm. Samuel, Karen Duff. Uh, aggravated assault. <laughs> Matthew Davis, I love it. S <laughs> up the rescue. Drink driving. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, Barry, struggles ruin. I'm gonna pop your head off. Oh, that's Eric. That's Robbie. Hi. <laughs> Do like a flip. Do a cartwheel. Like. Holy oh, fuck. Come on, Casolo, go! Hi, I'm Chris. Did you know witchers are the only silent hostile mob? Yep, you can't even see them coming. And Jesus. Fuck Cammy. <laughs> Harry's right, <laughs> this thing's a hoot. Shepard, Kieran, 53 Regiment Battalion, 165 confirmed kills in the Congo. I'm here to make things happen. And I'm Daniel. <laughs> Hi. My name's Lady Bell. My name is India Lister. Yo guys, I'm Duncan. Hi, I'm Harriet Elizabeth Watt White. Hi, my name is Daisy Griffiths. I'm, I'm a member of Flat Party G. And my best friend is Cameron King. Now that you're introduced to the teams, it's time to begin this year's recap. It's only one hour before the event begins and teams are already arriving. Let's see if they're confident in their chances of winning. Yeah. What's going to do at interviews? Hello, I will be doing your pre-game interviews today. I am the off-brand Cameron Kane. Guys, like to uh, come join me for my interview. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> Say no. How are you guys feeling about today's challenge and do you think that you will be uh, winning, winning today? We have Els on our team, so no. Yeah. Well, no one else is here. Well, yeah, actually, well, Finley's down there, but he's going to be sleep. How are you feeling about today's event? Do you think you're going to do well, or do you think you're going to do like shite? I think we're going to go all the way. Going to go all the way, yeah. Going to win the 200. All the way, yeah. And the Glens. And the Glens. <laughs> what qualities do you think you'll bring to your team? Um. <coughs> uh, well, thank you very much. That was a great interview. <laughs> Okay, uh, how do you feel about today's event? Uh, do, you, do you think you're going to win? Do you, do you have any clue what you're doing? I'm, I know, Angus is dead. Angus, I think. Uh, how are you feeling about today's Shit. event? Shit. <laughs> Anything else to add? No. Nope. No, okay. Oh. Yo, yeah, holy fuck. Yeah, I got fucked up here. Like yeah. He's got dreads. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, Angus. Where's that from? Yeah, Finley's asleep down in the garden. Oh, really? Oh, 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 Finley, um, oh, thanks for taking time out of your busy schedule to uh, um, <clears throat> be in this interview. Um, are you feeling energised after, after your little wreck? 
they, they can come and join us. Do you feel confident you're going to win or do you, do you not have a choice? No, I'm good. I'm just I'm just too uh, tired of the lab. Right. 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 Thank you for your time, friends. Like, right. Right. Are you sure you don't want to no, I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> because some boys are really neat. He's boosting the retention of the audience. Yeah, no, everyone's watching. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, you feel, you feel, you feel <laughs> very confident. You feel very confident. You think you can win? And for the money. We're for the money. Not, not for the fun. No. Very serious. For the money. Okay. Well, uh, thank you, Tessa. Who do we have here? Ellis Chicken. Ellis Chicken. Ellis Chicken. Ellis Chicken. Alright everyone, let's play a fun game called Let's Pack 31 a Garage. Uh, so yeah. 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 You know, squeeze in! Squeeze in! Yeah. Everyone squeeze up! Fucking head off my head. Right here, search and destroy everyone! Yeah. Yeah. Essentially, uh, you probably don't know what you're doing, which is good. Uh, you've got all day to do one very simple thing. You need to touch Harry Betty. Mm -hmm. Oh, where? Simple as that. I actually heard you. Do I win? Just go. Where? Well, <laughs> that's our good friend. Don't okay. get Harry will not be able to leave the certain areas in. So if you figure out where he is, then you basically have to go fucking chase him and catch him. Uh, we'll give you bonus points if you tackle him to the ground. <laughs> Somehow, even with the film student, we managed to miss the beginning of the event. So we'll have to skip to here. To catch you up on what happened, Harry appeared at the front of my driveway and quickly ran off, causing some of the contestants to go chase him, whilst everyone else decided to look at the first challenge. The first challenge was simple, all you had to do was go to a park surrounding Clarkston and take a team photo. The catch? Only one team were allowed in each park. Well, as we can see, everyone's currently reviewing the first clue. I have no idea where any of these parks are, so I cannot help at all during the Do you want to go Scout Hall? We're not going to make it. Scout Hall now. It's too late. We're already I would go to Ernest Drive Park. Right. That's near where I live. Can we visit your parents? I want... They're divorced, though. Oh, <laughs> uh, parents. Okay, bye. The catch? Only one team per park. Look at these fucking idiots with a fucking camera. Right, right what, what are we doing once so, we get to the park? You, I'm following these cunts up there. You see? You're hurt. You're hurt. They know where they're going. We don't. So as soon as they get there, we're just gonna do one just of these. Just gonna run ahead quickly. Oh, <laughs> we've got more. We've got yeah, more. Yeah. We'll get a the shot old of funny old man. These are Look at me. He's <laughs> judging me for putting the pack away. Look at that. What a silly old guy. Also, before we left, I asked Cammy if I could use the Oh yeah, we had a plan. Oh, yeah. oh. Very, very long time ago, Cammy came to our flat okay. and stole all of the aces from oh. our packs of cards. Oh, oh shit! I, yeah. Nice. <laughs> Paul, you 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 were, you were filming and you messed us talk about Harry Bumsex. Paul's filming Sunday. You can see here. I'm gonna have to film you to film. Filming Paul. You film you. All right, so we've got some like behind the scenes. Yeah. Yeah. Are you filming? I'm filming you. Alright. Do you want to film me? Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh man. Right. What the bad stuff? Nice heart, right? Now yeah, imagine oh, everyone, everybody else did like, So, like, where are you going? Um, so, we are going to... Uh, give me a wee second. We're going to... Greenbank Gardens Car Park. Car Park? Greenbank Gardens. Uh-huh. And we're going to get there. Uh, two teams allowed. So, we, we've got this one in the bag. Within 10 minutes, some teams were already getting close to completing the first task. And within 10 minutes, we had already fucked up. Trust me, we'll get back to the action soon, but let's take a trip back to November of 2022. Harry and I were sitting in my room, conceptualizing Search and Destroy, and this Harry guy goes, Here, wouldn't it be funny if I ran out in front of everyone at the start of the event? And I'm like, yeah, that's cool, but do you reckon you can outpace 30 folk? And he's like, yeah, mate. I'm a hundred percent the fastest cunt about, don't worry. And I'm like, you sure? Anyway, fast forward to now and... I'm on it. They found the Harry Berry. They are chasing him. Down in the forest. <laughs> they have found the Harry Berry. This is 
We found him already, mate. It's over. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> So we ended up having to politely ask the four teams that caught him to keep doing the challenges as intended. Whilst that was all kicking off though, teams started submitting their team photos. As simple as this task was, some teams seemed to really struggle with it. They stole dog park from us for talking to them. Oh. Fuck them, okay? Fuck Ellie. You see this in the video, Ellie? Fuck you. I'm never covering your shit. Okay? Probably watch Mike around the kids. Mike, how do you feel that there's loads of kids out here? For legal reasons, I cannot comment. <laughs> no, 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 here, sure. That one's better, okay. Yeah, but like, for the most footage. Just take... Just seen okay, and I realise that I have Cammy's card from, from yeah. buying Tesco's. So I, I do just have his card. Like, but it's probably not flat, so you should probably censor that. Ross is taking a pit. Hi, Earth. Now, you can do it. Did you get one? You can do it, Robbie. Yeah, I can't even fit. Like, I can't move my thing because my legs are too fat. You don't know me, son. You having a good time? It's Gim Cheney. Yeah, I'm fucking loving this. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> can't miss this. Just some first challenge, Cameron Kane approved. Everyone, we're ready for the next video. Speaking of the second video. So, the scheming has begun. I want to be an old man. We've watched the second, the old second video. Lydia is going to be, an, we're going to get an old, we're going to find an old man somewhere and ask him to introduce himself as Lydia. The second task was to create a short team introduction. You know, the ones you saw at the start of the recap. Just a little reminder, we had Harry Berry school fight recreation, chronic heart condition man, such a poor attempt at being funny, I honestly felt bad for them. Uh, how to get Docs 101. I love it. So uh, whatever the fuck this is. Uh, the Gamer Bible. And this poor old woman who got dragged into a skit. My best friend is Cameron King! The keen eyed among you might have been wondering where the hell are 100 to 1? Why are they on a bus already? Oh boy. Yeah, but what did the video tell you to do? What's the second video? What did the second one tell you to do? Oh my god, no, this is where we need to record. Wait, are we recording still? Yeah. Yes! Watch the second video. I would recommend getting off the bus before you watch it. We have to go back to school. Okay, What do you mean? What do you mean? You have to. Did you not watch the video? Second video, they're not specified where to take a one-minute introduction, so we're going to do it on the bus or when we get in Glasgow. Is that okay? Sure, cool. Sure, yeah. It was a third challenge in Paul Clarkson. I won't say anything, because that would be spoiling things. Motherfucker. Okay, that's fine. Okay, <laughs> So for whatever reason, 100 to 1 were hard set in taking the bus to Glasgow after they did the first task. I have no idea why they didn't even watch the second video. <laughs> Luckily for them, they opted to do the team introduction on the bus instead of waiting till they got to Glasgow, because the third task was to build a fort in Lynn Park, which is about a 20 minute walk from Clarkston. When they eventually got sent the third video, they finally figured out they were being complete idiots, which led to this gem of a video. Right. This is terrible. We this just got a bus past the base where we're supposed to go. Because if you look at the video, so fucking late, some fucking reason we're 15-20 minutes away from where we're supposed to be. 
We were we were ahead. We were, we were actually. I think we were just we were fucking winning. And here we are. We're fucking we're fucking we're so retarded. It's outrageous. Nice. Unbelievable. Funnily enough, this wasn't the only team that was pissed off. Cammy, 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 no. <laughs> we want to oh, yeah. Bobby want to have a bone to pick with you. So you know how we forgot his surname and you forgot my surname. So we want an apology video. One minute long. We want an apology video we do. from you, Cammy. We do. Mr. Cameron Kane. Hey everyone. So there's been a lot of hate going around. And to be quite frankly, I don't think it's justified. You know, I do try my best. And I do know a lot of people. He's in the Miranda Sings. What is he doing? Because you know me. Apologize for forgetting your last names. <laughs> Uh, Owen Davison and Bobby Rugbyman, <laughs> the toxic disco train. <laughs> this you got a one-way ticket to get yeah, in. Yeah, you can play the challenge. The well done. Can we get some <laughs> Right, we've got a little bit off track. So where were we? Uh, oh yeah, the third task. Let's see. Uh, go to Lynn Park, build a shelter, find food packaging and alcohol containers, and take a team photo in a fort. Let's see how that goes. Okay, so we spent half an hour trying to send a video. So the top size <laughs> students plus Ellis are nerfed by our technical skills. Yeah. yeah. Lynn Park. Lynn Park. Where the fuck is Lynn Park? Quick lunch break. How you feeling? I'm a bit scared actually. Yeah. I don't think we're doing as well as some of the other teams. I think we're doing, we're popping off. I think we're doing great. Oh yeah, you've got the I Love Monster badge! Yeah. <laughs> it does not belong to Fraser McDonald any longer. Fraser Cammy K. I love Cammy K. Would you mind just taking a video of me and my friend really quickly? Oh great, that's so nice. Uh, me and Daisy Griffiths just want to say, we love oh, you Cameron K. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. First drink of the day, we're on the Scotland Scotland merch. I, I love Scotland. Scotland. Oh yeah. Right, so, me, Sam, we're showing it here. Well, these monsters decided to get an ice cream. Right. All right, Lynn Park, trips. Going to the, the bridge. Find a sign. Video number three. Right, okay. We're on the train now. For like two stops. One stop. One, one stop. One in. There's, there we go. We're missing uh, Lachlan and Jude because they're, uh, they're, they're a way to get funny things. And, and inshallah, we'll get this done. Quavers make me feel like shit. Quavers are pretty bad, to be fair. Yeah. And then you, your fucking bad. hands up and your breath. Yeah, fucking yeah. tell me about it. <laughs> um, we just found another group. There's three of us here in Lynn Park. Have a box of cigars. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. You got the car. Can, 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 can we You might have noticed a hundred to one walking out of Lynn Park by the time everyone else made it there. Yet, yeah, somehow, despite the bus debacle, because we looked at the video so fucking late, they were still in first place. We just done the task! Enjoy, fuckers! <laughs> even I was surprised at their speed. So did they even build a fort? Is that a four low? It's a four low! Oh my god! Absolutely no fucking way. We just found some fucking Kit Kat bites. Fucking Kit Kat bites. Yeah. We have built our fucking shelter. We got some alcohol, some munchies. We got some mayor alcohol, mayor munchies. And we got fucking Jamie in the crib. Ah, so I see our MTV cribs, yeah. As you can tell, it's covered up. Absolutely rainproof as well. Okay, we got the fucking jackets. And we got the big ass log. We built it ourselves. Here they are. It's not quite what I expected, but I appreciate the shithousery. Speaking of, for anyone that's not done one of my events, shithousery and sabotage are key components that I actively encourage. And this challenge was a breeding ground for...
Oh, 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 Okay, okay. No, come on, man. No. <laughs> we're sabotaging, sabotaging you. Alright? Yeah, we're gonna fucking kill you. No. Okay. We'll kill you first. No, we'll Look kill you first. Look at our fucking base. It's gone. L, L, massive L, eh? <laughs> no, 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 no. I see Whoa. what you're doing. I see what you're doing. I'm paying my respects. Leave me be. Hey, here we go. Robbie's kissing again. After all the fighting, some teams still managed to pull off a great looking fort. Other teams, however, took a more abstract approach. Regardless, all of the teams eventually completed the challenge. As expected, 100 to 1 were winning, being almost 15 minutes in the lead. Three teams contested second place, whilst everyone else trailed behind by half an hour. The next challenge was slightly different. Long story short, you could do what the video told you to do, which would have taken much longer or decipher a hidden phone number and fast track yourself onto the next set of challenges. Unfortunately, everyone managed to decipher the phone number. Besides, whose phone number was this anyway? Something oh, funny. Just... <laughs> I'm phoning the shed. Okay, we have to take a picture of outside the shed. That's right, the shed. So all the teams had to do was take a team photo outside the shed. Next stop seems to be Charlotte's. Let's go to Domino's. Fuck you. Pizza is better. Are you working pizza? I'm a manager in pizza. I'm a fucking manager in Domino's. Oh, fuck. Get away from me. Fuck you. No, fuck, fuck you. No, fuck you. No, fuck you. Oh, my God. I uh, forgot I've had your hell in there. Look at all these people on the bus. Oh. Shed bound. With a clue. We've got Eric with us for some reason because his team's eat, going and eating. My and team don't have stamina like oh, I do. No, no. Okay. Eric went on over to the shed while the rest of us are all hanging out here. We're gonna eat something. Thank you. Daisy loves my farm. We have accumulated another group. We're in a mega group now. We, have, we are in the giga group. <laughs> do you guys want to go get groomed? I would love nothing more than grooming right company. There. Whilst Daisy and India got groomed, every team got to the shed, with a few teams losing members along the way. Now the very keen-eyed among you may have noticed something off. I'll give you a couple seconds to figure it out. If you guessed that is a picture of Finley two months ago coincidentally doing the exact thing you had to do for Challenge 5, then you're correct! And of course, I sent them the next challenge before I checked the date on the photo. So well done, Finlay. Best shit history of the day. Go on, everyone give him a round of applause. Another round of applause! Let's see how the stand-ins are now. Makes sense that the Impractical Jokers are now in the lead, with 100 to 1 right on their tail. The rest of the teams, however, were starting to fall behind, so we decided to give them a helping hand. So, we gave the bottom three teams a forfeit to do. They could skip a whole location if they did one of the following challenges. Ask for Prime in the tune of God Save the Queen. Sing Tequila at the back of the bus. Tequila! tequila. <laughs> or let your phone ring out in your pocket as you call it from a stranger's phone. Surprisingly, the only team to do a forfeit was... Hello, good day to you. Do you have any time in stock today? <laughs> now, if that wasn't bad enough, we forced every single team to do one of the three forfeits before they could continue with the rest of the challenges. Basically, teams were doing far better than we expected, so we had to slow them down a little bit. A teensy little, a little bit of a... Uh, drop. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Tequila! Tequila. <laughs> oh, fuck Cabby. For real. Fuck Cabby, for real. They're, they're probably getting it right now. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> they're, pro they're probably, they're probably getting it. I'm, yeah. I'm sure it's just in there somewhere. <laughs> like one of them, one of them must have somewhere. One of them must have found Anyways, there must have been something in the air in Shawlands because everyone started to get a little bit funny. One, two, rizz up my shoe. Three, four, yant some more. Five, six, Ohio kicks. Oh, that is so Bennett Foddy. Alright, we're not the like now. In the back of- Go on, do it. And then I'll jump over you. Huge. Holy shit. Go on, do another one, guys. I can fight Oh my god, this is insane. I have watched all of the Skibidi Toilet episodes, and I'm so excited for the new episode. Yeah, the recent episode. Yes, Skibidi Toilet, yeah. man. Have you watched it? Nah, I'm not oh, you need to watch Skibidi Toilet. I even, I even played the Roblox Skibidi Toilet. Oh, that is, that is too It real. went so hard. You're a real one. Oh, shit, it's a fast. Oh, we found a goddamn, we found a goddamn, look at this motherfucker, man. Yeah. Oh, I got my man, I got my man. Find a friend. Mans. Let him in the grass, you can oh. get him. Saving the wildlife, bro. Saving the wildlife. Come on, bro. come on, jump, jump! Yeah! Look at that! Hi, excuse me, excuse me. What? What's the volume of your balls? Oh, I creep right away. Oh, okay, <laughs> thank you, thank you. I've lost my team, so I'm with, I'm with this guy and these guys, and we're drinking. Yippee! Eventually, the teams began their journey over to the west end of Glasgow. We had the choice of interviewing people with strange objects or sinking one of the fabled GUU mega pints. Unsurprisingly, every single team chose to drink. I've just found out that the next challenge is downing a mega thing, right? Oh, because of us, yeah. yeah. And we're, we're already fucking I've drinking pints, done two pints already. This is fucked. Give him a wee kiss, give him a wee kiss. Give him a wee kiss, give him a wee kiss. It's all consensual. Yeah, for two points. Fuck off, Ellie. <laughs> I'll push you on the tracks. I'll push you on the tracks. Right, I'm gonna go like that. I'm gonna push you on the tracks. So you've got to be hiding all those, so you're quite lucky. I think that was fun. Yeah, no. Originally, it was built for drainage, but not doing a good job on it. Nowadays, people use them to like stop people from committing suicide and stuff. Grim facts. Grim facts. Cool train fact about the subway. You know, St George's Cross. There used to be like, there's a lot of controversy about the Saint, like the apostrophe in St George's, right? Because it used to just be St George's. But if you go, if you go outside, you'll see it on like one of the signs. There's not an apostrophe, and they changed it like, like in like the 70s or some some stupid reason. I don't know why. <laughs> Facts are down. Do you know that? The, do you know that the Glasgow subway is the third oldest subway in the world, behind Bulgaria, uh, Budapest, and London, uh, obviously in England. Here we are, West End. We're walking towards GUU. I have no idea what that is, but we're doing that. We're doing like a hard challenge for the shed. We're getting pints, is what we're doing. Yeah, yeah. I got this hatchback, and everywhere I go, your wife gets laughed at. And when I'm in my car, I'm laid back. I got an A-track and a spare tire in the back seat, but that's flat. Fight. <laughs> Fuck you, Tommy King. <laughs> Fuck you. I heard that prom night is a bomb night with a hood ratchet and old type of really dough. Figaro, when in my car, I can't even get a hello. Well, so many people... The Impractical Jokers and Flat Party G moved on to the next challenge, whilst everyone else filled up the beer bar. By this point, I think most teams were there for just a little bit of fun. Someone eventually realised that there was a jukebox in the beer bar, and in a surprise to nobody, all hell broke loose. Yes! Yes! I'm just Ken, when I see love she sees a friend, what will it take for her to see the man, behind the tan, I'm fine for me. You. 
Whilst that was a beautiful moment of teams in union, other teams were having their own fun. I say right foot creep, oh, walking with that heat. Look around, stay low. Can you tell me something your mum doesn't know? Yeah, sure. Uh, um... Sorry, what are we meant to be doing again? Everyone finished up their drinks and headed off to the next challenge, which was over at King Tut's. Teams had to travel there to be sent a secret image and a code to decipher. Nobody filmed anything relevant to this, so I'm just going to throw some videos in of teams on side quests. Go set a prime. Is it worth it? <laughs> we're not doing your thing anymore, we're doing a sub crawl. We're doing a, we're doing a sub crawl now. Bye, Cavi. just solved. No, we just got the next clue, so we're on the way there. Daisy is on the beverage. Oh. Who's this? It's, uh, oh my god, is this him? Oh my god, it's, it's the, oh, the man of the moment. Oh, man of the moment. Shit. Wait, who the fuck is this? Our <laughs> Duncan Crossan is on the phone with Harry Benadryl. <laughs> we found his number. We found him mm -hmm. and we are coming for you, Hanny Benadryl. Hanny, Hanny, Harry Benadryl. Hey, Cammy. Hi, Cammy. Hi, Cammy. Hello. We're all, uh, Hi, dude, we're all fucked up. Like dude, I'm, dude, portion. this is fucked. <laughs> King Tut is happening. Harry Betty is going to get destroyed. We're about to get to the Harry Betty is about to get searched and destroyed. destroyed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not the other side, the other side, the other side. Every team cracked the code pretty quickly, and to be honest, this wasn't an exciting challenge. It was simply a setup for the next challenge. The deciphered code read Go Piss Girl. What did that mean exactly? Welcome to Piss Review! <laughs> That's right, every team had to get one person to audibly review their own piss down to every last detail. You can thank Lachlan for this idea. Right, so this is, this is a piss review. Um, pass down by the ankles, because that's, that's a real piss. Oh. The colour is like uh, the inside of a crunchy. It's, it's going well so far, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, um, it's definitely, I'd, I'd give it an 8 out of 10. The feeling is like that of um, the burning of a furnace. If you put your hand over a furnace, it feels very much like that. There's, uh, there's, a, lot, there's, a, lot of, um, there's a lot of pressure to it. Yeah, that's my best review, 8 out of 10. Hello, so we're doing that piss review right now. Um, it's quite clear, to be honest. Um, yeah, clear, like white, or not white, obviously, fucking stupid. Like, you know what I mean? Like, there's no coloration on it. Um, it's very hydrated, actually. Um, can you hear it? Can you hear it? Oh, I mean, oh, it's good. It's solid, it's solid. There's no blood or anything, but it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'll, overall, I'll give it like an 8 out of 10, so it's to Kamiku. Yeah, okay, we are up with another piss review. This is Ross McDonald's, here we go. Alright, pretty refreshing. I've been sat in a barber's for like half an hour. I was needing it the whole time. Yep. I'm pretty well hydrated, it's pretty like clear. Pretty nice. I, th I think it's pretty loud, it'll show up on the camera pretty I hope it does. I <laughs> um, don't really know what else to say about it, it's pretty average piss, but I was needing it, so quite, like, quite good to get out. Mm. Smoking a fag at the same time. Here's a piss review. Um, this is the fucking weirdest task you've given me so far, but there you go. Uh, it's a uh, normal piss, fucking desperate. That mega pint did not help my man. I've uh, sacrificed a lot of my fucking self-respect to this. Bro, oh, that's <laughs> a fucking strong piss, man. I need to. Join. 
Nah. That was scary, not gonna lie. Mine's strong too. Oh, he's not there! I'm joining you for a piss! Oh, we're pissing together. There yeah. we go! Teamwork, yay! This will be a strong piss for you. There we go, we're pissing Right, together. wait, wait, wait. We're waiting, we're waiting, we're waiting. Right, on you go. <sighs> Ready? So, this is a good piss so far. It's feeling nice. Good ejection of my um, oh, I'll spray my legs, you fucking ming mong man. How the fuck have you made ah. such a small puddle? I was doing it tactically. Honestly, it's Tack piss, legs. man. Tack. Okay, um, feel the water is still at a pipe right now. Like it yolks the fucking water. Oh. So, guys, I'm kind of annoyed because I needed a piss before it was cool, before the, we fucking saw the clue. <laughs> The no fog. Okay. Oh, piss off the <laughs> piss off the gate. Piss off the gate. Literally, piss off, off the gate. gate. He's about to, about to piss. Duncan, right here, about to piss. We're next to a church. We're, about to We're in an alley. Here we are. Okay. <laughs> Stop the view. Piss time. Okay. Okay. Piss time. Okay. We'll piss. 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 Start peeing. Piss go. Oh. oh my god. It's, a, it's heavy. Oh my god. <laughs> Duncan has pissed a lot. Duncan is a hydrated boy. It wasn't, it wasn't long last. That, that was like frying that was, chicken. That, that actually was sounded like he was heavy. frying chicken right now. After all of that, the next challenge was to make a video skit to simply make us laugh. Simple, right? Oh yeah, and there was another. Piss review. Hey guys, it's Bobby Stone here. We are pissing in a place recently acquired by, like, Architects Limited. Just for Bobby's sake, I think we're going to end things there. Anyways, the team skits were really long, so here's a 10 second summary of each and every one of them. Yeah. <laughs> you want him alive? When he fucking funny point out. Yeah. <laughs> that Ross boy's got an atrocious cut. So fucking shite. He's getting a fresh cut. Get back here, get back Come here. On, Come on. Hey guys, I'm going to Firewater now. Look at this guy, he's fucking having a vlog. Look at these guys. He's fucking vlogging each other. Skim uh, Army. Come on, Skim I'll Army, unite. Yeah. You that I'll fucking kill you, I'll mate. My shirt, Marcus. Marcus, I'm Paul Allen. You mistaked me for Marcus. New business card. My new business card. South Lennox Shirt Edition. Comic Sans font. Right, here's our comic this guy. Michael Andrew, man. He's so unfunny. I'll cut him. I love drinking. You know, that gets an entire fucking grip in salsa to laugh. How hard is it to get Kama Kane, right? And finally, the final challenge. Harry Berry. The super secret undercover agent is hiding in the Glasgow necropolis and the teams need to go hunt him down. Now, for some context, we never announced when the first team caught Harry, so every team don't know if they're first or not. So with all the teams chasing that prize money, let the hunt begin. <laughs> fucking kill Harry, Betty. Fucking kill Cammy. He fucking killed Cammy. He shot him. Just got the last clue. We're on the last fucking clue. Last, last fucking clue. We, go to the we are on the way. Harry, Betty. Fucking watch out, okay? Everyone else is very close behind. Yeah, but, but we have at the end of the day, on, who's so. winning? Where we are? Where are we, we guys? We're on route. This is it. <laughs> the bag on. I see him. We're going for him. No, 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 no. You finished the challenge. Fucking hell. Question, come here, bro. Well done. You managed I to ran. Set a target for the day. I ran. Update, they've all found them and they've all ran off and I was getting my phones like a video, but they're, they're gone. Oh, wait, I see them. Hang on, you guys are steaming, all of you, I bet. Oh, I'm not steaming, we're all steaming. <laughs> we spent the kind of time on the phone. Hey, how are you doing? I've just fucking tackled Harry, right? Like, properly tackled, kind of tackled and brought him to the ground. Um, hopefully, hopefully we've just won it. So it's just me and Chris, we're going to the pub. So, let's go, we might have won it Chris. Hopefully, God's praying. Final ball. 
so cracked out. Cracked, toes, so spent, absolutely knackered. I'm on my bed. And that was it. The event was over. It was certainly a chaotic six hours for everyone, and people needed to relax. Everyone eventually headed back to a function we had for the day, where we announced the winner of our mini rewards, and finally, the winner of the entire event. Uh, can, I get, can I get a bit of quiet in here? Can I get a really bit of quiet? I've been waiting in the Acropolis all day for this. Hi everyone. Okay, where, where the fuck's he going? Oh my god, he's first. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Where's, where's the guy? Oh, Sit the fuck down. Okay, best team introduction is um, Drummo. Drummo. <laughs> team Hard Carry! There's <laughs> the runner up. There you go. Are you want the runner up? No, it's not a runner up. Oh, and then the winner. Is Black For the the best four, the runner up was the Jokers, which is Paul and all that. The winner of that one was Barry63, which is Daniel and... Oh, this is a good one. All right. All right, Capiche. This is a big one, big one, big one. Best photo of the day. Ooh. Now, we're, now we're cooking, now we're cooking. So, the runner's up. The runner's up. <laughs> of the best photo. We don't need to drum off this one because this was disappointing. It is Hard Carry! Yeah. Yeah. Run around! Woo! Yeah! I'm so sad! <laughs> and in first place, now give us a drum roll for this one. The other one. Oh, best clip. Oh, for a clips channel now. Yeah. And the runners up for the best clip goes to Science Team. Yeah. Let's go. And the winners. Now, actually, this is quite funny. Can we get a drum roll for this one? For the best clip of the night goes to Kill Me. This is the best pitch review. So the the runners up, the, the runner up, the the person who did this pitch review was Sam Skivens. The winner of this one was Duncan. This next one is. There's not even a runner up. Oh. There's so clear cut that we weren't even like, oh yeah, that's like a second. We were just like, no, no, there's one person that won. And this next one is the quickest mega pint. Oh. <laughs> there he is. Look, he already, he already knows who he is. <laughs> this is the last the Go. Oh my god! 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 Hey, most filming. Yeah. Well, you can probably guess again. The guy with the camera. The guy with the camera doing it right now might might win. Um, but do it, come on, do it, go! It's a, it's a win. This guy, well done, Charles. Well done, Charles. The next one is the best forfeits. There's two runners up for this one because we actually couldn't decide. So the runners up is Barry63 and Under the Influence. That's Jude's team and Daniel's team. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Wait, what the fuck? No, it's Michael Andrews. Oh, Michael Andrews. Yeah. The winner, the, the winner of that one is Flat G. Next one is the best sabotage. Yeah, the, the runner up for best sabotage uh, is Flat G. The, the winners for that one were the Jokers for demolishing everyone's farts. For the most shithousery uh, that we saw today. Now, a runner up for most shithousery today goes to. Okay, Michael. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Support vocal, sorry. <laughs> Alright. Uh, the second most shithousery we saw today was from Flatchy! <laughs> but it could only go. To one team, and quite frankly, it would only go to this team. And it's the man taking his phone call right now. It's under the influence! <laughs> anyway, so, if you've been paying attention, we we have a winner of the awards. The winner of the Leader of Lens goes to... Flat Party G! Right, so... We're gonna go from last to first here. So you, th th most of you guys like think that you won. This is quite funny. I Just so we we have a reference. Nah, Hands up if you think you won or said you think you won. <laughs> so in last place, uh, I think they actually know this. It is hard guy. It was Kyle Dean. <laughs> Right. Yeah. So not last, second last. Honestly, I think that's like worse because you don't get the honour of being last or second last. The most forgettable team of tonight. The award goes to the Neeks. Yeah. Right. Third to last. So you're kind of like not bad, but we're calling you third to last, so that's kind of embarrassing. But you're like really in the middle, I guess, if you like break it down. But third to last. Third to last, guys. Big, big, big applause to Science Team. Right. Bang smack in the middle, right? And kind of a surprise for me, it was the Impractical Joker! <laughs> this team thinks they won, so it's getting intense. This next team has already been giving me a bit of lip under the influence over here. Give a big, big round of applause. Do we have a for Evan? Yeah. Now, on to the bit you actually care about. So, the winners of tonight's event Ooh. is between Barry 63 and Flat Party G. Yeah. The winners are walking away with 200 pounds! The winners by a landslide! Flat Party G! Soldier boy, I'm in it all! I think Greg, you want me all! Now to Greg, that soldier boy, that Superman! Oh, I want me you! I can't thank you all enough for taking part in making this so amazing. I hope you had fun. If you would like to sign up for this year, there's a link to a form in the description. And that's all from me. Thanks for watching.